All right, so we're still here at Anfield and I've got another wonderful legend to talk to, Ian Rush, great, great Liverpool player. And um, Ian, thank you very much for joining me. Yep, Say hello yep. to, to the fans in Ghana. Liverpool hello everyone fans. in Ghana. Great, great. <laughs> Ian, uh, let's talk about Liverpool. Where does this team rank for you in your wonderful history? Well, well, they're right up there. First of all, you know, um, you, we want to be winning things. But uh, I think this season's been absolutely amazing. You know, Jurgen Klopp's done a fantastic job. The players have been fantastic. And it's just unfortunate that we come up against maybe a team, you know, very, very strong team in Manchester City. But, uh, you know, to get to last game of the season, uh, to have a chance to win the league. And for 10 minutes, you know, we, had, we were top of the league. And... Uh, it didn't happen, but we've got the Champions League to play for, and uh, I thought the support uh, at the game uh, yes, was, was absolutely man mm. magnificent, you know, and it's, uh, it's got to keep that going for the, for the game in Madrid. Mm. Yeah, that's a difficult question I have to ask you, because if a Liverpool fan asks you then, what do we need to improve next season, mm. what would you say? Well, I think they've, all, they've overachieved at the moment, but, uh, you know, you still, they set standards, and, uh, you know, yeah, it's difficult to say. It's difficult to criticise the, the squad this year because they've only lost one game. Yeah. You know, and uh, but yeah, I think they'll learn from the experience. And uh, I think, especially uh, they got the final in Kiev last year. You know, they, that's that's set the standards. And uh, to get to the final again, but this time, uh, hopefully, you know, we can go on and win the game. Final one. Look at that Liverpool um, turn around against Barcelona. Four goals to nil after lost three goals now. New camp. How do you rank this? That's a, without, I, I know you've seen a lot of well, comebacks. I've seen a lot of comebacks, see all, but uh, at Anfield, I say at Anfield, that has to be the best comeback ever at Anfield. <laughs> it was absolutely amazing. Not just because it's four goals, because we're playing Barcelona. Yes. You know, Messi, Suarez, Coutinho, yeah. all these. Uh, they're, they're a good team, but we made them look a very ordinary team. And uh, that for me, uh, the atmosphere was incredible again. But uh, to make that comeback, it's got to be the greatest comeback at Anfield. You have quite a number of Africans who, after yep. the Champions League, yep. will be preparing for the Africa Cup of Nations. Yep. What, are, what are your your, your hope, you know, for them? Like Sadio Mane, like Matip, uh, like Naby Keita, like yeah. of course Mohamed Salah. Well, it's going to be amazing. I think uh, they're going to be. You got to be careful because they're going to be a bit tired as well. You know, they've had yes. such a demanding season, uh, especially with Liverpool and all that. Uh, but I think Mane's been the. Um, he's been played for me uh, one of the best strikers around this season. You know, Salah last season was fantastic, and they, they, what they've done now, they've allowed two people on Salah. So it let me manning free a little bit, you know. Yes. But he's true. He's he's, he's capitalised on that, and uh, he's been absolutely magnificent, you know. And uh, Kate, you know, with his injury and everything, uh, hopefully he'll be fine for that. And uh, you know, it'll be, it'll be great to watch. Thank you very much, Ian Rush. Uh, there's more definitely coming up here as he's watching a game right now involving UK Standard Chartered Trophy 2019. Thank you, Ian Rush. Again. Thank you. Yeah.